Hey, well, how's everyone doing? Good, I hope. Yeah, yeah, the Atari VCS is awesome, you know. You know, and, you know, I'm going to go back and look at the old, all the updates that were uh, going on while the Atari VCS was in development, like, you know. And uh, there was over, there was uh, 44 updates in total before the VCS was um, shipped out to us, you know. And uh, it, it, it went through four stages, you know. Concept, prototype, production and uh, shipping, you know. So this took about two to three years to, to complete, like, you know. So I'm going to, like, you know, because people might be interested in what the uh, development process is like for the Atari VCS, you know. So, yeah, now, it's just far too far update, so there's a lot to go, go through. But, you know, every step of the way, we believed in the Atari VCS project. And, you know, it, here we are, like, you know. And it's awesome, like, you know. So, uh, so... <clears throat> So I'm gonna go to uh past up to the updates, you know. Right, so this is the, the very last update, you know. Uh uh by Atari January eighth, twenty twenty one, you know. So uh <clears throat> getting ready for uh you know, we are we are excited that the Atari features hardware has been shipping these past few weeks. You know, uh, so really, it's about uh, the the VHS getting shipped and stuff. Uh, they were saying that uh, the first update for the Atari VCS could take twenty minutes, depending on your upon your internet um speed. You know, um, so it's telling you how to set up the system when you get it, uh, and if having any issues, contact Indiegogo. Like you know, so so that was uh. Uh, 43 I believe you know uh, yeah you know so then uh, this was the uh, 44 happy holidays 2020 you know this is when you know the happiest day of my life happened you know Christmas Eve 2020 you know half 11 in the morning I got my Atari VCS the years of waiting finally over like I couldn't believe it like you know and it, it was awesome you know and uh, the 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 uh, UPS guy gave it to me. I need I need dropped it. I was so happy, you know, <laughs> and it was awesome, you know, and um, it was awesome. But this is what I'm saying. That I kept people updated in the loop of exactly what was happening, you know. Um, so, but people were still kind of scam, like even though like stuff like this, you know, was out there, you know. So, uh, this is such an exciting time. We're thrilled to see that so many of you are getting the Atari VCS into your hands. Yep, brilliant leak, you know. Uh, brilliant stuff. Um, saying it's been a long, long journey, but it's finally over. And brilliant. And that's exactly how I was uh, when I got my Atari VCS back then. And what, in 2020, I was that excited, I was that happy. It was like, it was like deja vu, like, you know what I mean? Except my brother wasn't there. <clears throat> <clears throat> at the time he was in the kitchen uh, but I remember like, just like that you know and we got the Atari VCS uh, my Atari VCS my original one in 1983 uh, now I wanted to get one before that but it was sold out everywhere and I had to wait till 83 before we could get uh, an Atari 2600 you know so it's awesome like you know um, uh, uh, so Brilliant, you know, got, got a feeling 2021 is going to be a great year in the right, you know. Shipping has begun, like, you know, this is the next uh, update, you know. And uh, brilliant, you know, so, I mean, th th these are just some, some of the updates, you know, that uh, Atari kept people in the loop of exactly what was happening, the, uh, detailed updates, more updates. And this is what, the, the reason why I'm bringing this up the entire the Intellivision Amico does nothing like this as far as I know. You know, but then again I'm not a backer. So but uh the Atari VCS is coming, are you ready? This was the fifth of December twenty twenty. Oh boy I was, you know, and now this Atari VCS is uh, a demo unit. This isn't a retail unit. And you can tell that because it's not classy leak, you know. Whereas the re the, the the one that we got is matte leak, you know. And uh massively, you know. Um 
they were showing off at, at the DK of, um, event in New York City. And awesome, Nick, you know. Um, uh, now, now they, they were telling us in this uh, update, it's coming from America. So uh, people in Europe have to have a US plug adapter so we can plug it into, uh, into our sockets. Uh, so that's the thing uh, when I got my Atari VCS, I had to get um, an adapter so we could plug a US plug into my um, socket. So yeah, uh, I'd say now uh, they, they ship uh, uh, plugs for the reason that you live in or you sell but when I got my VCS to tell us that because it's coming from America, you have to get a US uh, plug adapter. So, see, they, they, gave, it, they gave us this inf all this information, like, you know. And the next one, Thanksgiving, you know, the, the 25th of November. Just one month out from getting the, the Atari VCS. You know, so, awesome, like, you know. And when the Virgin is shipping out the first batches of uh, the Atari VCS, uh, the customs finally released uh, the joysticks yeah because they're, they're all sitting on pallets because of uh, COVID and everything else and slowing everything down and stuff um, the, the VCS world is classic joystick update you know uh, so to tell us all, all about the joysticks so this is exactly why I was excited because they kept telling us things uh, about about what was happening more updates so now i don't know if this is if this is what it was like with the amico i doubt it because i didn't see it and like you know and um, the october this is october 2020 they, they started sitting on pallets and even when this pre see the haters still didn't believe this you know what i mean they thought that it, some fella said uh they're pillows you know what i mean like you know they just wouldn't believe what they were saying like you know that the haters like you know and um, one of my Atari VCSs was in one of them boxes and we got it uh, 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 Christmas Eve 2020, uh, you know. Uh, sorry, 2021, yeah. No, no, 2020, yeah, yeah. I got, yeah, Christmas 2020, yeah. Yeah, yeah, December 2020, yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah see, uh, I'm losing track of time myself, like, you know. So here's exactly what's going on. All Atari VCS units and uh, modern controllers uh, have been um, earmarked to fill backer orders. Uh, yeah, so all America will get their stuff first and the rest of Europe and stuff. Yeah, so awesome, you know. And uh, people are asking questions like, in, um, people are asking questions like, uh, why did the joysticks take longer than everything else? Uh, as an all new product, um, as much as like the Atari VCS itself, there was a tremendous amount of uh, fresh research and development that went into the major new peripheral. So yeah, I mean, they were testing out, make sure everything's hunky dory. They didn't want to release a, 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 a crappy item, so that's it. That's another shot of the, uh, the VCSs on pallets ready to go. And that was that one, no. So basically, like, so uh, Atari VCS partners with Plex for streaming media. Uh, see, they kept, they kept, they kept us updated, you know, with, with every update, you know. And that's what the, uh, the, uh, in television should have, should have been doing with the Amico. Uh, I don't know, like, you know, we, we still think it's not going to happen unless, you know, they get $10 million and they start building the things. Uh, now this one was a, um, uh, a Q and A with the COO. Um, uh, so he's telling us that the VCS units eight hundred uh, joysticks and monitor controllers are for sh shippings will be starting this fall with a, an all new blog post to share. Like you know, uh, in indie creators, a community you know game got jolts. You know was announced. You know, so yeah, I mean, we was excited, I was, and we didn't doubt any of this, but the hairs did, like, you know. So, anyway, I, I just want to show what a few what the updates were like during the, the development process and the stuff that we was excited about, you know. Um, so, I asked some stuff, like, you know. Uh, you know, this one is uh, July 14, 2020. 
um, uh, Atari Arts Air Console over 150 games, which is cool. But them games, they're mostly indie sort of games, but you can use your phone as a controller. This is Command Recharge, because that them was, I was excited about that, that update. <coughs> you know, so, awesome stuff. It was awesome, great game, like, you know. And, uh, <coughs> Yeah, the, the, and there we go, the first pallet of uh, production units is here. Yeah, there's a man loading onto a truck and the hair still didn't believe this either. You know what I mean? Like, this is what Amico fans want to see. I mean, they want to see on um, pallets, want to see it being shipped. But are they getting this information? See, uh, I don't know. I don't know. We have to wait and see, but it's not looking good with the Amico. There we go, plenty of photographs, and there's the, uh, that's exactly how it looked when I opened my Atari VCS, it was in a box like that, just like that, and it was awesome, like, you know, when I need to drop it, it was that, um, uh, happy, like, you know, yeah, so that, that's just a bunch of updates uh, during the production uh, um, cycle of the Atari VCS, uh, my testing in May 30th, 2020, uh, you know, and people were calling this a scam as well, like, you know. So that's, I just make, I want to make a quick video about that. And April 23rd, April 23rd, 2020, Atari VCS production officially begins. So that's when we actually started building them, like, you know. A date and time, 6.50pm. Now, we, have, we haven't seen anything of the Amigo doing that, and that's what they have to do. To, to convince people that, yes, the Amigo is real, but they're not doing that. We just think that the people in charge of the Amigo are, are taking the money and run. And I don't think they have any intention of releasing this system. I hope I'm wrong now, but this is what the Intellivision have to do. You know, and we'll, we'll see, but I don't know, like, you know. So, I just want to make a, a quick video about that, what the, what the um, updates were like. Uh, Atari VCS, um, managing the unexpected. Uh, this is when the pandemic was really in, um, starting off around, I you know, um, Uh, about the pandemic and all, uh, but they still kept working despite all this. You know what I mean? They kept, they kept doing the, the impossible. But but such a smart team, even during the pandemic, they they kept working instead of lying to people and stealing their money, which is what the Amico is, is doing. Like, you know, so yeah, I mean, so it's our forty four updates, and like I said, they kept us informed every step of the way. Like you know, and that's why we believe in them. You know, um. Uh, now this one I never heard. My wonder join forces uh, cross platform and gaming. Uh, this uh, actually didn't come out for for the VCS yet, so it's still my who knows. I uh, might have a different name now, but this I've never seen wonder on the VCS leak. You know, uh, manufacturing update. Now this is when they actually showed it in the plant, February twenty twenty six twenty two p.m. Like you know. And people were still, they're showing it being built, like, and people were still calling it a, a scam. There you go, like, the photographic evidence. And if you open up the VCS, the inside is, is like this, you know. You know. And uh, this one, uh, the meeting suite, you know. Um, CES 2020. There it is, like, you know. Uh, so there you go, like, you know. So I hope everyone has a good day. This is just the, the updates from when the TV says was in development. And this is what the Intellivision Amico has to do. They have to give people a manufacturing day and, and stuff. I hope they do. So I hope everyone has a good day. And the VCS is awesome. I love it, like it's, it's it's brilliant, like you know. And I hope that the VCS, the the Amico people, get their system, you know. So I hope everyone has a good day. Take care, boy, boy.